Aloha. This is I, Marina Love from www.lovemovement.ca. Today, I am feeling inspired. What am I feeling inspired by? I'm feeling inspired as a conscious relationship coach to bring to you some wisdom and knowledge that may help you get through the hardship of your day or not it may just shine some light your way I'm not sure I don't know I don't know anything all I know is that humanity needs an attitude adjustment and it really breaks my heart to see how cruel we are to ourselves and how that translates into us being cruel to others and I'm so sick of watching it I'm so sad to see all of these broken women who have not learned the art of femininity who don't understand that that beautiful expression of the divine feminine that exists within them that is being suppressed perhaps is actually the key and the secret to unlocking everything that they desire in their life and I'm saddened and I'm tired of seeing these broken women who have never gotten in touch with their femininity or their divine feminine that lives within them, their goddess, their inner goddess, raising children. Because what happens when these women raise children is a broken woman raises a broken child, which translates as a broken future for all of us. So we really are responsible. And it's time that we start thinking about this because I've watched for so many years, I've been a victim of it myself, and I've been an observer of this type of behavior for a very long time, is that people really don't treat people the way they want to be treated. And then they wonder why things in their lives are not good. They wonder why they don't have the life that they want. They wonder why their business is not going the way it should be. They wonder why they can't attract a partner. I don't know about you, but <clears throat> you may not be able to connect the dots as to why this is important in that situation. But the truth is, and the truth remains, that we really, whatever we hold inside of us is what's reflected outside. Whatever we hold inside of us is what is either an attraction tool or a deflection tool. So you make the choice as to what you want to attract in your life. And I would really like to see people getting in touch with themselves because I would say that 90% of people alive today do not know who they are. And they have no idea how to communicate. They have no idea who they are, how to communicate, and then they wonder why everything in their life is falling apart. And they wonder why they can't sleep at night because they've treated so many people badly along their day. And they wonder, and they wonder why. I want to stop these, the wondering why. I want to bring some more awareness around this. We need an attitude adjustment and we need a new way to, to be with one another. How are we as a society going to evolve into a deeper love and understanding if we don't freaking learn how to respect, honor, cherish, and love one another? Today, I stand beside you, not in front and not behind. I stand with you as a human being, as somebody who is wanting to make a change in the world and more so someone who is embracing and embodying the change that they want to see in the world. So if this information was useful to you and if it really touched a deep place inside of your heart, please send me a private message. I'd love to talk more about this with you. I'd love to hold your hand and walk you through this transition into heaven on earth because it does exist. No matter where you are in your life, you can have anything you want. This has been Marina Love from www.lovemovement.ca. Thank you so much for watching.